Hi, I'm Emily Benjumbo. And I'm Mackenzie Garrens. Thank you so much for coming. Welcome to All New. We just wanted to take you around and show you some of the cool things we like to do around here. Let's go. Matthew, don't you love our gym? I love our gym. You're gonna love it in here. This is where we get to play all our games and practice. Yes, so you see, we have the LMU logo in the middle. Go Lions! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yeah, this is where we are, men's basketball is, and volleyball is, but that's pretty much all who gets to use this floor. And yeah, it's just kind of our little sanctuary. So we're gonna go to the weight room. Time to get big and strong. <laughs> if you come here, you can help us get one of these banners. It's a great idea. So what's upstairs? So we have some conference room upstairs. We have meetings there from time to time and also have different speakers that come in to talk to us and we'll meet up there and talk to them. What's downstairs? Our weight room. We're about to go meet Drew, our strength and conditioning coach. We're good This is one of our new facilities. We actually got a new weight room, so it's all redone and has super nice weights, and it's just really fun to come in here because it's a good atmosphere. You play music, pretty sure I can hear it right now. Yep. All the LMU athletes come in here to work out, not just regular students. This is especially just for athletes. Only us. Yes. Repetition maximum testing, okay, which is how much weight can you lift for one rep? And the goal of that is to see how strong you are, it's a measure of your strength. So, right now, we want to see are we at our strongest, right? When the season begins, how can we improve it? How can we can maintain that throughout the year? Um, what does that mean for our athletic abilities? Um, I mean, we have several goals for strength and conditioning, but the main one for me is staying healthy and then putting ourselves at a competitive advantage by being the strongest fitness team on the court. Thanks, Rossi. Is that it? Yep. Yeah. It was nice seeing you. Right. Go Lions! You too. Go Lions. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. <laughs> now I'll take you down to the campus and help you check out Alumni Mall. Tons and tons of schools that are just here to help you out, give you some information, and just put you in the know. Ready? Let's go! Our beautiful 
chapel up ahead. It kind of overlooks our whole campus. It's one of the high points of our campus. We'll take you there later. Hi, money. We're all friendly around here with other athletes. <laughs> <laughs> this is a place where you can just stay and just be relaxed. You can do anything you want. As you can see, someone's reading a book. Here's a place to relax, commune with friends. Awesome. Especially when it's still this nice out in October. Huge perk. Huge perk. Combo is a really relaxed hour. You just kind of want to be able to hang out and just kind of not be in class and socialize with whoever. It's also a common time that people go get food. Another form of transportation that's common on schools right here is bikes. Bikes are always nice because our, our campus is big-ish, but not so big where it's like if you had a bike, it'll take you from point A to B pretty quickly. Right here is the coffee cart. They have food there, they have snacks there. If you're trying to get to class quick, you can grab some and then head out. So here is Alumni Mall, and this is what Combo Hour is about. There are booths set up. You can check some cool information out. These are all grad schools. There's lots of good information for you. place on campus I would have to say the bluff which is just past the church right there all the way over there yeah, the bluff gives a nice overlook of downtown and you can see all the streets and the bigger buildings it's a really pretty area to just kind of go and get some air and just kind of relax <laughs> Campus, <real> <laughs> Morgan what you doing what is this for it's a grad school thing. <laughs> Morgan's actually one of our team managers, so she helps us during practice and always make sure our laundry is clean for us. It's really nice. We love it. Hey. Thanks, Morgan. Bye. Bye. We can actually go over here and show you the fountain. You have to tell them about the tradition, Matthew. Oh, the fountain. Fountain is actually a fun place. We have a tradition at LMU specifically where kids on their birthdays will be thrown into the fountain. Oh, no, this is across the board here. Yeah. Yeah. So it's common at midnight that kids will be carried and or dragged to this town and be thrown in at the on their birthday. I have avoided that and I'm, I'm not thrown into in. that. <laughs> the experience was a little bit chilly, a little bit cold, but it was it was so fun. It was so fun. Our fountain currently has died. It looks a little more purple, but it's actually pink for our kind of our breast cancer awareness. We also, it also gets dyed green around St. Patrick's Day. And yeah, it's kind of a little fun thing. And also sometimes they have an LMU line class for the uh, yeah. Well, it's time Italian, Japanese, what else is there? Chinese, yeah, I mean, there's just salads, there's sushi, there's sandwiches. ice cream. Don't forget about the ice cream, Maki, and I forget about ice cream. <laughs> Pizza, burgers, chicken strips. What's your favorite food, Maki? Mm, my favorite is when they have the bread bowls, like clam chowder in the bread bowl. Oh, love it. You know what's crazy is I love their salmon and mashed potatoes. So good. So good. Can't go wrong with mashed potatoes. How healthy is the food? Um, actually that's kind of up to you because they have some pretty good healthy choices. Like there's a really, really nice salad bar where you can get some really good stuff when they put it on for you or you can go to their own salad bar and you can make one yourself. So it's kind of up to you and then they also have like just like some grilled chicken breast that you can add to your items. So you can have a pretty healthy lunch. Dinner, it's breakfast. your choice and LMU gives you choices. So now that you've seen just a glimpse of campus, we're going to take you to the coaching office. Come on with us. Coaches' office is a really nice place to honestly be just wanting to go hang 
out some of our teammates to like study hall in there because it's just kind of nice atmosphere. You'll see there's like couches, there's kind of tables, and they're always there if you need to talk or just want to watch some film, anything. It's just a really open door policy, nice place to go sometimes. Oh, and they even help you with your homework. Fancy that. Coaches are probably all in there. Hard at work on your recruiting process. Trying to get you here as soon as possible. In this office area, also, this is where all of the athletic offices are. So, not just ours, but men's basketball, tennis, soccer teams, baseball, softball, all their offices are in here. So this is where kind of we all collectively work as a team to keep our teams running. Here we are, we're gonna take you upstairs. Basketball has their own personal suite. We have a pretty nice setup up here. Sometimes they collectively get together to watch games even. It's a cool spot. Knock knock. Who's here? Ladies and gentlemen, Chris Elliott. Hello. Bum, bum, bum. What are we doing? Oh, look, we're just hanging out, showing a tour of our campus. I wanted to show the crew. Very exciting. Welcome to my office. <laughs> Chris Elliott. Hard work, 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 work as usual. Ooh, guess who I saw ducking behind the door. <laughs> there she is, the one and only. Cherry Elliott. Elliot. <laughs> are we having a good time on our tour? Of course we are. Yes. I'm going to oh hey Kiva. And look, there's Kiva back in her little nook. <laughs> are, are, are you guys answering all the questions? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We're showing buildings and everything. Awesome. They met Drew. Nice! That's perfect. Yeah, they even met long ago too. They got lucky. That's perfect. Yeah. Coach has the biggest office in the mall. She's yeah. special. Would you I like to see it? Yeah. This is a real setup in here. Coach, what are you working on? Um, I'm writing some uh, thank you notes, actually. Awesome. Yes. From our little campers that came to oh, the clinic. We got a nice little thank you from some kids that came to a clinic. Where did you get that? It's a long story. <laughs> <laughs> Won't that be fun? Yeah, it's going to be a team project, an art project, where we color it and we put like LMU. I actually have two of them. One of them is a little broken. Another <laughs> long story. Who steal these from? No, 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 no. Um, I brought them back from Missouri with me. So nice. Um, but won't this be fun? We'll paint. We'll do a little art project. Are we gonna make fun of basketball? Yes, yes. So thank you so much for coming, and we hope you enjoyed this tour. Yeah, we had a great time with you. Yes, Coach Elliot. Thank you for coming. We can't wait to uh, show you around again. Can't wait to have you on an official. See you soon. Bye. Bye.